coming to you from another location with another exclusive shot about the Arcturian message. Not being afraid of what this looks like, how we look like, and how we present ourselves. The question is, is how do you perceive your conduits? Real simple. Police officer wears a costume. Your court jester wears a costume. The judge wears a costume. The janitor wears a costume. In your everyday life, you wear costumes that are popular. So when your mind cannot fathom or figure out where the costume fits, you belittle, you judge, you label. Reason why I'm wearing this and I'm transmitting to you live through this conduit data streaming from a very, very energetic spot, which is a lava ground, which is like 500 years old, so very young, very fresh, mineralized energies that are emanating from the ground, thus enabling us to establish a communication link to source code, which enables our cells to communicate to you much clearer. The following message is, as you are being activated as an ascender, those who would like to join this conduit, Dr. Ra, in the ascenders group, under Google, it is free. Please join us as an environmental group to preserve and protect and uphold the environmental energies and bring back the original face, conjugate places, and structure henceforth that what's to be on Earth rightfully. 5D is already here. The opportunity to access five-dimensional technology is here. It is now survival of the smartest, not in a bad sense that you would die. You would probably go extinct if you won't follow the route or the way the ascension path is illustrating itself. We're simply here as a representation of the Arcturian planetary constellation, Botus constellation, Northern Hemisphere, to tell you to allow your mind to adjust to the new frequencies. So as Earth is getting hit by new plasma waves and new photonic influx and information, which is a zero field zone that's coming closer, waiting to be fully activated by your conscious awareness, you feel like you lose weight, you gain weight, you're going through all types of crazy scenarios in and out and around your life. If you are in a place that is not face conjugate, literally to your heart, you will be propelled out of there. Whether it is a marriage that won't last, whether it is a relationship that should last, whether it's a combination of things or seasoning within the food that will no longer match because you are no longer in resonance. So don't be afraid. Let's say you're about to go to the movies and you have a panic attack about on being on your way and on the way to the movies, an accident occurs and your fear dissipates. That has to do with your primal instincts, your cosmic self is coming more in, and your senses turn on. Back in the ancient times when we didn't have electronic equipment to telecommun telecommunicate and um, call the others when we were in the field, we used telepathy and other things to protect ourselves in the environment. Now imagine you're an ET that is not known to the human vessel as it is right now, waking up into your vessel. It'll be very complex and complicated and confusing. For those who want to know what that means, as an ET, higher sense is picking up and confusing you because you have no reference. Watch the latest Superman. When the boy is around 10 years old and all his senses kick in, because Earth radiates, Earth is very chaotic, Earth needs a lot of adjustment, humans, neurotic humans at that, need a lot of adjustment to come back to the original senses, it can be very confusing. So once these higher senses and higher modulations kick in, your slim switch begins to kick in, meaning eating regulated. You gotta watch now your planetary objects. You gotta watch the stars. You have to adjust to what Earth actually asks you to adjust to. Hydrate properly. Have the proper light. Stay away from too much electromagnetic frequencies because it derails and defaces your body. Bathing in Epsom salt, we recommend to bring the phase back to your system. Uh, rose oil, essential oils, healing modalities such as what our production company um, Clear Activate produces, photonic devices in your home to regulate the photonic environment. This is not uh, for this conscious to be a sales pitch. This is about resonance. That is about where do you feel okay? Where do you feel in balance with giving an exchange for correcting that that you will be in independence, not having to come back, 
not having to readjust all the time, not having to cleanse your crystals all the time, not having to cleanse and sage your household all the time, coming back to a place where you would have something, what we prefer as a the photonic household cell that clears the environment in a long range, in a very, very, very big radius. So um, it is all about adjustment, correction, transformation, transmutation of the body and the channeling of the correct and efficient energies for your body which is efficient for you obviously we seem to be of higher interest for certain energies that are here so we shall continue the message to you is keep calm integrate the highest state of awareness be yourself understand the higher senses that are coming in Follow the instruction of the higher guidance. We had an experience where we were driving an earthly vessel, which you call a car, driving up the road, and a voice said, not uh, this lane, we'll advise you to take the next lane. So we stop, wait, not in fear, proceed to go to the next lane, and an accident happens parallel to us. That was known two miles before approaching the intersection. That has to do with higher senses kicking in. So in the morning liquids, between 12 and 7, heavier foods. Between 4 and 6, you can eat really heavy. Keep it light. If you want to eat around 1 o'clock, have it be a salad because the photonics are hitting your photosynthesis. That means your light perception of your cells is being jacked up. When that increases, you shouldn't eat heavy foods. Real simple. The body adjusts better and less food is needed and your ideal weight is coming back. So diets in the future won't be needed. Books in the future won't be needed. Books are a mere reference of a slower or lower consciousness trying to perceive higher dimensional aspects. In the future, when your angelic state returns, you will integrate fully your higher self. And if you need a data stream, you will simply just tap into the data stream, ask a question, go to bed, this is the old method, and wait for what stream will unfollow and what stream will reattach and then follow you, and then chord with you, and then in accordance to your permission, you perceive knowledge. Same thing if you have, if you have social networks. Know what you're courting yourself to. If things don't happen according to your divine plan in your sacred space, disconnect, unfollow, block, or ban to keep the path of your development and ascension path and process clear. So we hope to see you in the Ascenders Google group. You'll find us there. Soon there will be a Facebook group as well, and more information about energies and how these things unfold. So from here till the mid of August, intense energy is going to be released, intense sunlight is going to be released, and you have to get clearer and clearer and clearer with your intent and in your mind, and learn again to control your thoughts, thought management, thought directive. Thoughts are you feeding? If it's an upsetting thought, you should stop feeding that thought. So get in gear. Mental hygiene. This will be announced over and over and over again. You have to know how to mentally keep your consciousness clear and clean from things that are upsetting to your emotional body. You are more crystal and water based than you were before, meaning you'll be more sensitive to these finer fields coming to you and don't think you're crazy or you're losing it no you're waking up to your higher senses and now you're learning to integrate those into the body bring in aspects into your body let's say one morning you wake up and you're like i don't know who i am you look into the mirror you don't even know who's looking back at you these are interdimensional parts that you have called back that are not familiar with your body nor your personality give them time to integrate to learn based on memory who you were and now who you are becoming this process is a constant process, but yes, as the sun ray and informational data, data streams are changing, hitting your DNA and RNA, thus you're getting into repair mode, more will come, more will change, more it will have an effect, and it won't be like all of a sudden you're moving objects or you're levitating. That is when you reach a certain level of speed or momentum past the speed of light within the cell structure, then these extra magical skills come in. Imagine the movie Back to the Future. What did the DeLorean uh, have to reach in order to jump timelines? 88 miles per hour. Uh, double infinity. 
So your vehicle needs a certain speed in order to jump timeline. Just according to the protocol and according to what's being transmitted and get more inclined with what has to be done. This is Starfleet Commander Arcturus Vagranku representing the Arcturian Council signing off.